all different and every hive is different. Well, they've done a pretty good job of that, Jane. Take one of these. One hour and 43 minutes. That's, That's amazing, isn't it? Mm. So, are you experimenting with walls and no walls, or are you happy with the design you've come up with? <laughs> I'm oh, pretty happy. I just keep playing around with minimising the ticking. Yeah. Yeah. Look, at, look at these bees um, streaming. Fundamentally, with this concept with stingless bees, I'm where honeybees were 100 plus years ago. They were just coming to grip with frames. Nice it's nice and heavy too. Yeah. It's so simple. And beautiful. Now, I should learn how to do this for the camera, facing the camera. And <laughs> oh, that is even better for you then. Look at that, isn't it beautiful? It's fine. Yeah, right. There you go. Now, Here, it doesn't seem to trouble them. I guess I think it's like a big merry go round ride. <laughs> <laughs> and there's not many bees under there either. This is the funniest one I've had. I'm not even going to bump that and I'll still hunt. There's a few bees there. Everything I do is to minimise. Uh, the loss of bees, the killing bees. Uh, this is the table I used this morning, uh, and I leave the bees on it, and I count bees. <laughs> Because I've only just applied power to these. I 
think I need a heavier cable. The other plan because at the bottom of these tanks there is a small tank. I don't really know what how much it really takes. The other hive I had had bloodwood honey in it. And bloodwood honey can be stringy. And just by gravity it won't go through that mesh. Like it will sit on top of that mesh. My, my engineer was very thoughtful. I, I gave him the basic sketches. Uh, we, s we sat down in his workshop. Uh, and he said, well, we'll have to make it so it goes in the dishwasher. This was part of it, <laughs> disassembled. Uh, I do have a very understanding wife. Uh, she does have to check the filter. Um, the, the, I, I did look at the filter at one time and I think it might have had to go outside and have a pressure gun. And if things go as they should, You'd end up with different flavours too, depending on what flowers they're. Yeah, 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 it would.